up, familia? Welcome back to the channel. If you are new around these parts, hello. Thank you so, so much for clicking. I'm Anna, and on this channel, we budget plan and love us some sticky paper, friends. But in today's video, we are doing something a little bit different. So for those of you who are new to the channel, I recently came back from a Disneyland vacation and your girl picked up some things and I thought it might be fun to do a little bit of a Disney haul kind of instead of my typical sticker hauls. Um, on the channel, I thought I would just do kind of a Disney merch haul and show you guys what I picked up both during the trip and before the trip for the trip before the trip, before the trip. Y'all know what I mean. After the haul, I'll be adding some pictures and a little bit of video from uh, the trip. I'll be completely honest with you guys. The pictures and video I took were really just for me. I did, wasn't planning to share them, but I thought it might be fun just to give you guys a little bit of a glimpse into my vacay and a little bit into my life. Um, so I thought that would be kind of fun. I'm gonna go ahead and move some of the stuff so we can go through them one by one. And I hope you guys enjoy. Let's go. All right, you guys, so the first thing I wanna share with you guys are my mini ears. I picked these up from Little Ears Boutique on Etsy. I'll have the shop link down below. You guys, they have so many options as far as ears go. Like I could have easily bought like 10 of them and I limited myself to three and it was with like a whole lot of taking it out of my car, basically. <laughs> like a whole lot of talking myself out of the ones I really didn't need, so like you will find something that you like, I'm sure on the website. Uh, if you've never, you know, haven't heard of this shop, they have tons, they have a ton of good reviews. So I'm assuming it's probably a pretty popular option for Disney heads. So I picked these up. One of the things I really love about this, they have like these little spikes here on the bottom. So they kind of, kind of stick to your head a little more, which I think for these is important because they're very lightweight, you guys, like very lightweight ears. Um, I would definitely, if you're gonna buy them and wear them, or if you wanna buy them for your kids, like take these off during any like thrill rides because they're pretty light. <laughs> But it is good that they have these like little spikes so they can kind of stay on your head a little easier. Hopefully you guys can see like those little spikes I'm referring to. Um, but it's really awesome. So of course I got the Black Panther one because Wakanda forever. <laughs> like Wakanda forever. Okay, forever. So... <laughs> got the Black Panther ones. I, you guys know if you are friends to the channel that I absolutely love Black Panther. He is my fave superhero. Then I picked up the We Don't Talk About Bruno ears and it's just, I love the detail you guys, like the glitter, the like little rat. It's just so pretty. I, I just love it. Um, so I picked these up of course in honor of Encanto. I thought they were so fun. And then I just picked up these very classic kind of mini ears uh, with like the classic, um, all the classics. So the classic red bottoms and the yellow bow and the, you know, the Mickey hand. So I thought this was perfect. I love the little like red gemstone in the middle. So classic, but perfection. This one's it's hard to say which one's my favorite, y'all, because I really love all of them <laughs> for different reasons. But I feel like the classic one, I think it's that bright yellow bow that does it for me. Like I, your girl really likes the vibrant colors. So I think this one, I just could not say no to. And trust me, they had Loki ears. They had everything. I think they had Thor ears. They had literally everything. I was hardcore debating on those Loki ears because they were so stinking cute. Um, so I'll have... Um, uh, little ears boutique link down below you guys can definitely go and check out the shop um shipping was great like I don't I didn't wait a very long time I did order these like super in advance so it wasn't even a worry for me um but if you have a trip coming up just check the shipping policies to to make sure you can get your ears on time um, I didn't wear these as much as I wanted to on my trip you guys because it was hot <laughs> like it was hot so I ended up wearing my hat uh for a bit but I did try to wear them you know when I could and I wasn't like dying but you know it's hot y'all it's hot so that's everything for Little Ears Boutique now we're gonna get into the things I picked up from Disney so let's go y'all so the first thing that I picked up you guys was this little like wallet holder um I should let's let's cut off this tag so we can get a good look 
Um, she was $16.99 of my life. Listen, y'all, trust me. When I tell you these prices are outrageous, they're absolutely outrageous. So just so y'all know, just be prepared. If you're bringing kids or if you're going to Disney and you want to get souvenirs, like, it is expensive AF. <laughs> so I picked up this cute little card holder. Obviously, it's Winnie the Pooh themed with the little honey jar. I just, I love the colors. I think it's so stinking cute, you guys. So if you open it up, you have some space here for your little card holders. What, three, four spaces for your card holders here. And then um, if you flip it to the back, you can take off this little red you have like a little like clear pocket here which is perfect for like my uh like train pass and my work badge like id for work because i do need those things <laughs> on the daily to get into work and to get to work um so this is perfect since i have to tap it and things where i work so i love it it's so cute i love I love how the little honey drip is happening in the bee oh and I didn't even notice you guys do you see a little poo bear peeking his oh my god I cannot I cannot <sighs> Disney always gets me that's why they take my coin <laughs> All right, so that's my little card holder. I'm I actually really wanted to haul this so that I can go ahead and like start to use it. I want to go ahead and transfer all my stuff over to my little card card holder and to drum roll please. My new Mickey wallet. I mean, this is kind of like a clutch. It's kind of big for a wallet. Um but I am in love, you guys. I love this bright red. Like love this bright red and I love the like drawn aspects of how Mickey is laid out on this so I love it says Disneyland Resort in the back that was another reason you guys since I don't know I mean I'd like to go back to Disneyland soon um I don't know how soon I will go back so I wanted to pick up some of the gear and stuff so if I open it up yeah so I could use this as like a purse because it has a little extended strap here but if I open it up we have the two like pocket sides could definitely stick cash envelopes in here um sinking funds really because my cash envelopes are the smaller ones but I love all this space here so you have these pockets so you have these smaller pockets two so these two smaller pockets and then two of the bigger pockets and then you have a ton of card slots which you guys I need all of them not in not even because I have a ton of credit cards but just all sorts of cards gift cards rewards cards like I just cleaned out a purse not even the current purse like an old purse y'all and I'm like what <laughs> like where did all these cards come from that I never took out of this old purse and mind you, I'm the girl that's using my current purse and then wondering, oh, where's my like Panera Rewards card? Like, what did I do with that? Where's this? Where's that? It's in your old purse, ho, because you never cleaned it out. <laughs> so, anyways, um, so we have the pockets here for all the card holders. There's another like bigger pocket in the back here. And yeah, I love, I don't think there's a pocket. Sometimes there are pockets back here, but no. I love this. I'm gonna stick this in here. Like this could definitely be like a clutch. Like I could probably go out with just this in certain instances. So that is awesome for me. And I just love the design and I love the bright red. I just feel like it's very summer. Like both of these, although very different are like, I feel like summer vibes. I don't know if I'm crazy, but I feel like it's summer vibes. Like with the brights, they just feel like bright, bold colors for the most part. So that is my little Mickey wallet. Is it called a wallet? Is it called like a clutch? Let's see. I don't know if we have an official name for it. I don't think I see one on the tag. Um, but yeah, I love this. Love, love, love. The next thing that I picked up are these super fun rainbow socks. Okay, fun fact, you guys. I love funky socks. Like. I love funky socks. I do not like putting on solid, boring colors. I socks. love these bright rainbow colors. So of course I had to pick it up. Um, so you have the socks with Mickey on them, Mickey and Minnie, so cute in black. And then you have like these rainbow colored ones. So this one is a little more monochromatic. You just have the blue greens and like 
purple pink and this is more of like the rainbow one over here and they have the mickey heads all over so i'm not going to take these off quite yet but you guys get the gist so i picked up socks i'm so excited who wear these socks I know, I know, I'm that person. Is there anyone else that really loves funky socks? Let me know down below in the comments. All right, you guys, I zoom you guys back out because we're gonna go into some of the clothing that I picked up. And I only really have, I think like two pieces of clothing. So this first one I've actually already worn. I wore it uh, the day we came back home. And <laughs> you guys, all right, we'll, let's see how we're gonna do this because I want you guys to be able to appreciate the whole shirt. So bear with me a minute, but so this is a short sleeve shirt and it's Edna, <laughs> Edna's on the front from The Incredibles. I'm going to try to get this as good as I can within frame, you guys, because I know it's a small little rectangle for y'all. Now but. it's just kind of a plain Jane kind of shirt. I feel like there's nothing like super special about it, but if you've watched The Incredibles, Edna is the best, like... <laughs> <laughs> she has me dying every time she's in a scene. So I had to pick it up. I love that she's got glasses like me and short black hair like me. Um, so I thought it was fun. And I don't know, I actually overheard someone who was also shopping there like geeking over it. And I was like, oh my gosh, I kind of love this. Um, so I had to pick it up. It's a short sleeve shirt. Um, I'll see if I can show you guys like the sleeves. So short sleeve shirt um, and yeah. That is my first little pickup. And then my second one, you guys. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Y'all, I've been wanting to pick this up. One of these, I don't, I don't even know. Like, probably the last, at least two to three times I've been to Disney. And I never have. And I finally did at Disneyland, you guys. And it is a spirit jersey. Like, your girl finally picked up a spirit jersey. And I didn't anticipate that this is the one that I would get, but I kind of love that I did. And you and I, let's clean this, you and I are gonna discover together whether or not this, uh, this rumor that is going around about these is true. So this is gonna be really hard to fit on screen. So I'm gonna have to show you guys kind of piece by piece, but it is the, um, the waffle themed <laughs> Disney spirit jersey. So they have tons of different themed spirit jerseys. I ended up getting the waffle themed. They've been going through this like, I guess, phase or trend of releasing snack related merch in Disney. Um, and I, <sighs> I had to get it y'all. So I'm going to try to show you guys as best I can. Um, so it's a long sleeve spirit jersey and I'll also pop in a picture so you guys can see like a full picture because I realize that this is really hard to see like this but um, it's a full spirit jersey and on the back it says Disneyland Resort which is awesome and then that's the top part and then the bottom part is literally a ton of Mickey Waffles friends it's just a ton of Mickey Waffles and what you and I are going to find out right now together is whether or not this smells like a Mickey waffle. The word on the streets is <laughs> that it actually smells like a Mickey waffle. So I'll show you guys the front too, that it actually smells like a Mickey waffle. So I'm about to smell it right now and put it to the test and see, let's see. It definitely has a smell, but it's not like a waffle smell. Maybe like a very faint, like super faint buttery smell. Let me smell the butter. Yeah, no, no, y'all, I'm not getting the smell. I'm definitely not getting the smell. <laughs> it just smells like shirt. It does, it smells, it has like a hint of sweetness to it, but it's very faint, like, like definitely not anything crazy. Like a very faint sweet smell is what I'm getting from it. Um, I'm so excited, you guys. This baby, <laughs> I don't know if you guys saw the tag while I was messing around with it, but this baby, I think, oh, it's actually not on this tag. That's how scary it is. Usually when I don't see a price on something, I'm like, oh, wow. Oh yeah, it says right on here, you guys, on this tag, not the price, but it does say that it's scented. So it's a very faint, like sweet scent. Um, but as far as price, I'm pretty sure this was like $75 or something insane. So, <laughs> but 
but here's like a more folded version of it with the cute little Mickey waffles, but it was about $75 if I remember correctly. I think it was like $74.99. Um, so I got my first spirit jersey, you guys, and I'm so excited. Um, and I can't wait to wear it. I need to wear it everywhere for $75. Like I'm about to, <laughs> I'm about to go to work in this. Like it's probably not appropriate work attire, but I don't care. We advising students in this baby. We might take showers in this baby. You know, we might, <laughs> we might go to the beach in this baby. Like I'm not playing. Like I'm going to be wearing this everywhere because <laughs> I'm going to get that $75 worth if it kills me. And it probably will. So <laughs> those are the things I picked up from Disney. So my waffle, Mickey Waffle Spirit jersey. I got my Edna t-shirt. We got the rainbow socks. I'm just going to be stacking stuff. We have the Mickey wallet and the uh, Pooh card holder. And then the three uh, Mickey ears or mini ears that I got from uh, Etsy. So these three were from Etsy, not from Disney. So I'm going to have Shop Disney and Etsy linked down, the Etsy shop linked down below. I do want to show you guys two more things that I picked up that were actually from Universal. I only got really one thing in a bag. <laughs> By a bag, I mean like literally a reusable bag. But you guys will see why I picked it up in a sec. So I'm going to show you guys that really quick. Um, and then we'll transition into the little kind of compilation of the photos and videos so let me grab that stuff all right you guys so your girl has zero chill right which we know we know for friends of the channel we know your girl has zero chill so i went to um the universal Studios store in at universal and so it was at city walk actually and they were like oh do you want a harry potter reusable bag for like i don't know two bucks or something <laughs> And you can get like the big or the small one. And I was like, I'm sorry, you have a Harry Potter reusable bag, sir. I'm going to need all of them. <laughs> so I got both the big and the small one. Because again, I have no real chill. So like, here it is. This is the smaller like little reusable bag that I got <laughs> with what I picked up because again, no chill. But I love the blue and the gold color. It's just so fun. So I had to pick it up. And then this is like the bigger size one. And I thought I might be able to use the smaller one for like lunches and stuff when I bring them. Because we all know that's also a whole struggle. Let's be honest. So <laughs> uh, I got those two reusable bags uh, with what I actually purchased. And you guys, I this is probably one of my favorite things I picked up. Don't judge me at all. Don't judge me. He's a niffler. I know this is going to be weird to see, but he's just so cute, you guys. Like, I can't with how adorable he is. Someone hauled his cuteness. Like, what the hell? Someone hauled his little cuteness self. Look at those little eyes. Someone hauled him um, on one of the channels, one of the millions of channels I follow that do these things. And I was like, I gotta have him. I gotta have him. So he's a Niffler, I think, but I don't actually know if he has a name in the movie. So if you guys know what this little buddy's name is, I will uh, put a picture in too um, so you guys can see him in action. Uh, <laughs> if you can't tell by this very large. <laughs> actually, he's not that big, but he does. I know he looks big on camera. Um, if you can't tell by this stuffed animal, I will pop in a picture. So if you guys know his name, oh my gosh, this is a little pouch you got. You guys know he likes to steal things in the Fantastic Beast movies. <gasps> it's a little pouch. I'm putting stuff in it. I have to find some coins and put them in it because we know my boy steals everything. He really just steals everything. And he's just so stinking cute. As soon as I saw Sirens, please exit my video, Sirens. <laughs> he was my one wish from Universal. I was like, I just need it. Of course, I wanted to pick up some Harry Potter things, but like they were just so expensive. And when I weighed like cost and worth, I was like, mm. Because I knew I wanted to, you know, I had already picked up a few things in Disney. And, you know, you already know that was a pretty penny. So I was like, all right, Anna, we're going to have to prioritize. And you're just going to have to go lay low on the Harry Potter stuff and just focus on the Disney stuff. So that is my little Disney haul. I hope you guys enjoyed. I know this is a bit different. I'm sure that this type of video isn't for everyone. So I totally understand if you, you know, decide to skip the video or 
it's not your fave video. I totally get that. Um, but I hope some of you enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up before you go as it really does help support the channel. Thank you so, so much for watching and supporting your girl. I'm going to go ahead and transition into a little compilation of vacation. Um, and I will see you guys real, real soon. Bye.